What's up YouTube, this is Prince with ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to change the badge color, your notification color right here on the top of your icons. So I'm going to show you guys how to change that and also how to get rid of the icon labels. But the labels, getting rid of them is kind of buggy as you can see some of them is there but the ones on the bottom is all gone. So it's kind of buggy, some go away but some don't. So do this at your own risk and this is in beta, this Houdini is in beta so do this at your own risk and I tried bringing them back doing the original but they wouldn't come back so yeah I got rid of them some of them and I tried to go back so I get everything it wouldn't come back I've been trying I've been trying it wouldn't come back so do it at your own risk it does look good though so if you want to get rid of your icons that's how you do but the, the, the badges definitely work so I'm gonna change the color of the badges and I'm gonna show you guys how to do this so you're gonna need tweet box links to it in the description just click on it, install it on your device, and after you get Tweetbox, I'm gonna open it up. And I also made previous videos showing you guys how to get the round icons and all that kind of stuff. So hit the X after this is Tweetbox. You go in there, you wanna go to Tweet Apps. You wanna go to Houdini right here, B2. So this is beta 2 right here. Tap on it, hit install, it'll install wherever you had space. There it is right there. So you want to tap on it. This is real buggy. It crashes. All kinds of stuff. It's going to give you a warning because it's in Tweetbox. The developers don't want to don't want people to use Tweetbox. They want to use the computer and City Impactor. So I have a link to the IPA and also a link to City Impactor in the description. So if you want to do it like that, but if you don't have a computer, this is the only way you're going to do it. You want to hit, hit ignore if you do it using City Impactor, you won't get that prompt right there. So you want to let it run. And you're going to get this interface right here. So you got Home, Sources, Packages. Let's tap on Sources. You want to have one source, my, my eye. And then Packages. This is where everything is. And Themes is grayed out. But yeah, so you have Resolution. Don't mess with Resolution. It does nothing. Icon labels, so this is where you go to change the icon labels. You could hit height labels, custom. Custom is when you like write stuff under the, there, whatever. The emoji doesn't work, and you have original. And I tried it, I changed, I got rid of the labels, but when I hit original to go back, it wouldn't work. And only some of them go away, as you can see right here. So that one has it, so some has it, but it does look good. So let's go back. Hit dismiss. So if you want to change the icons, change the label, just tap on it and it'll do that. But I'm going to show you guys how to change the badges. So you want to go here. It's an iPhone size. You got the original and you have other color. So for the color, you're going to have to put in the hex color. The easy way to do this is just go into Google and type in hex colors and it'll show you what it is. So I already have dark blue. I want to change mine to dark blue. So that's the code for dark blue. So basically it's number sign. Zero zero, and you could just copy it. I say copy and paste it in, and you'll be good to go. If you want more colors, you could just hit, you could just search, search hex color, hex code. And you could see all kinds of colors red, we already have red, but whatever color you want, you could just search it on YouTube, on Google and you get it so I'm gonna go back to the Houdini app and I'm gonna put in the code delete that out whatever is there delete it out hit paste and you can see automatically that up there changed to blue so that's the color I want and you wanna hit apply on respring if the respring doesn't work just turn it on and turn it off that'll work as well and I have some video at the end of this video to show you guys if you want to set it up however you lock screen and you can see right there the colors change of all the badge icon now it's a nice blue make sure to pick a color that's not too bright because you want the white to show because if you have a color like bright yellow it's going to be hard to know how many in the white so make sure you get a good color and all the icons so I actually like this look even though I can't get by my original after a update I'm pretty sure this will be working better because it's in beta right now so it's like you get what you get 
And let's see, let's kill the ad. Let's see if it crashes. Sometimes it likes to crash. But it's been working. You got to, there you go. And look at that, that beautiful boot logo. You guys could also use this to get boot logo. I have another video on how to do it. Let's go back in there. Ignore. Skip the ad. Let's see if it works. So you just gotta be patient. I know I know this is on beta, so so okay, there it is. And yeah. So you got you could change your icon shapes to whatever. So you got this little bar right here, you could adjust it just like that to whatever you want. Just like that, you could do that. Ad blocker, you could block ads. Emoji, you could change up the emoji if you want more of an Android style emoji. Boot logos, you could put any one of these as your boot logo. And all that kind of stuff. But in this video, I just want to show you guys the, to remove the icons at your own risk and change the, the badges. So there you go guys, it's Prince with ATP 101. I have a video at the end of this video showing you has how to get the round icons the other way and how to get boot logos. So it's Prince, rate, comment, definitely subscribe. Peace. Thanks for watching.